after I left camp, I knew I had to just hike up. It was a longer hike than I thought. And then I smelled this smell. I'm like, God, they must have a human waste disposal unit. But no, the smell was coming from where we were diving into, the swamp. Lovely. <laughs> what did we get ourselves into, eh? When I saw Martina, I just thought, you know, she's a top athlete. And I thought, oh shit, really? <laughs> You're about to compete in Spawn again. <laughs> Celebrities must race through the swamp, collect a spawn ball and throw it into the catcher to release the fluid. And avoid the spikes. The first celebrity to release enough liquid to float the key to the top may unlock the chest and return to camp victorious. Being one of the greatest athletes of all time, I figured, okay, I mean, she's got 25 years on me, but I got a little more experience. I was just so focused and the adrenaline kicked in, I wanted to win. The balls were actually a lot heavier than I thought. I couldn't get it up high enough. Once I threw the first ball and it slipped out of my hand, I'm like, OK, I needed to really get underneath it so it doesn't go off to the side. I'm a good goal shooter in netball anyway. For me, it was a lot better to just get the power and to get the fling. When I got the first one in, I thought, yeah, go, girl. Oh, good shot. About halfway through, Martina's key was raised a fair bit above mine. I thought, oh, my God. So I thought, you better back your ideas up. Got the key! Yeah! My team's going to be happy. God, that okay. stinks, you were right, that is what stinks. Oh my God, okay. I need a shower. Can't wait to get in the camp and get in the swimming pool. <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> I mean, for me, it's like, okay, uh, it's about ego, of course, but most of all, I wanna, I wanna get a treat for the team. So it's, it's a great feeling. Really disappointed, because this is the second sort of task I've lost now. My mind's thinking, how am I gonna tell the camp? And are they gonna be, think they've got a weak person in the team. So, advantage Navratilova. Huh? Good one. If there's one thing the greatest tennis player of all time knows, it's how to win. And if there's one thing the rest of them know, it's how to gossip. I'm really interested now to getting on over there in the other camp. Like, Who do you think is going to be the hardest out of that group? when they come over. Simon's lovely. I can't, he won't be a problem to anyone. So Robert Kilroy is, um... No, he's, 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 very, he's, he's very sure of himself. Like, he knows... Yeah, yeah, he's very confident. He knows what he is and... and he's very confident. Yeah. So that's why I was thinking him and Brian might clash, because they yeah. both want to be the alpha male in the camp, don't they? Martina's coming back. Where? I need help! Go help with Joe. Oh, well, look, she's got something. She stinks! Martina stinks! I stink! Oh, wow. Totally stink! Thanks. It's good to have you back. I'm gonna kiss you. <laughs> Stinky up. And all. I don't know. That's what it I didn't know. That's what it was in the like pool. A tank, like a mysterious you tank. I thought it was. Hello. Hi, babe. <laughs> I bloody <laughs> didn't get it. You didn't get it? Oh, bless you. I'm you so pleased to see you. I was oh. so concerned. Was it horrible? <laughs> I'm freezing and I stink. I have a sniff of them. Oh, naughty. Congratulations on winning the first head-to-head -head celebrity chest. You have won a visit to the other camp for one of your team. Inside compartment A is a gift. You may share it with the other team if you wish. Well, we know they've won dinner tonight, so, so we don't have to do that, Jerry. Let's, let's do it. Hot chocolate and milk from Holly and Fern. Yeah! Oh, oh, this Holly and Fern. I'd like to get out of camp. Oh, good. Because you ain't been, been out. You ain't been out. That's fair. I think he's got itchy feet now. I think Brian really wants to get out of camp and um, go and do something. Oh, Brian and Kewell work there first, mate. Head I think, real well. I think he's going to... I think they're going to bump heads, those two. I've never met Robert before. Obviously, I've seen his TV show. The first impressions oh, weren't too good at the hotel. See you later. But that might just be, you know, uh, a one-off bad experience. So it'll be good to uh, maybe have a bit of a chat with Robert and see uh, see how he's getting on. Do you know what I mean? Because I think. Do you know what I mean? Um, hello. Oh, 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 o
I'm afraid not. It's just a very short visit. Go on. Hello. Part of the prize this afternoon was allowing one of us to come and visit your camp. Oh, oh nice. Honestly? No, yeah, and for what reason? Sod off. <laughs> Go on. Go oh, away. See. You come really? to gloat. <laughs> yes, Brian. <laughs> I oh, no, to gloat. What else were they wanting to visit our us. camp for? Would you, would you like some hot it's, water? It's to see how awful we're, we're living got, so we can go back and tell us. <laughs> he said he'd come as a treat. And that suggested to me the treat was to kind of come and see how bad our conditions were and to have a quiet giggle on the site. What's the camp like? Is it much? Is it really good? Well, last night, I was going to sleep on the floor because my bed is so uncomfortable. Really? Honestly, I put my. Oh, would you want to swap? <laughs> <laughs> We're on the floor. On the floor. Right. Do, and just, you just, 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 just to go back on where I responded to you. Yeah. Tell me truthfully. Is sending somebody down to, as a treat to look to, to, to see us is to say, Christ, what well, there, a mess there are two, well, or, or is it because you were asking about there, it? There are, there are two ways of looking at it. One, one way is the negative way, to say, oh, it's just to gloat. You know, and somebody could have come from, the, from, from, from our camp and said, oh, well, you know, you know you're, you're in a terrible state compared with us. Yeah. But, but me, every time I've been in there, I have said, I'm really worried about what the other team... Honestly. honestly I mean, it was almost like this kind of man on a white horse suddenly appeared. You almost expected him to be full of some kind of bounteous goods. Why didn't he bring a present? And everybody gets on very well, I imagine, because it's a fabulous group of people. Well, we'd yeah. like to see him come around eventually, I was going to say, you know, it won't be long before we're all together, I don't think. Yeah. And then we we'll hate each other. Tomorrow. We've got the rations for three days. Uh, now, Brian didn't entirely convince me, but I accept his word. I didn't feel convinced, but I, uh, he, said, he said that was the purpose of his uh, visitation, and so I accept that. When you said you'd been asking about yeah. it, and that was your treat, that put a totally different complexion okay. on it, obviously. Yeah, exactly. And if that's the case, then I apologise. Oh my God, and the amount of food I throw out my house because it sits in the fridge and goes off. What we could do with that food right now. <laughs> Hello. Well, well, do tell. Oh, should we wait for yeah. Joe? Joe. Joe. Brian's back. Come on, Our representative is back. They see the ghost. They see the ghost. Pins and needles. Uh, so. What's the camp like? Let's start with what the camp looks like. So it's quite small. Smaller uh, than this. Yeah. But the first thing to happen was I got attacked verbally by Robert. I know. What was he attacking you for? What did you do? What did what you do? I, I, you've just come here to gloat. Get out. Oh, oh my goodness. He's a dickhead. You know that. <laughs> 